Hello and welcome to my channel. For those of you who don't know me, I'm Steph and today's video is the first in a three-part collab with my beautiful friend and soul sister Anki. Um, you'll find Anki's video videos and her channel linked in the description box below. Um, so Anki reached out to me and asked if I wanted to do a full autumn build your own palette. Of course I said yes because these are one of my favourite collabs to do. I love creating a palette. Hi Mr Fluff. I love creating palettes and Anki is the queen of build your own palettes. She just has the most amazing singles collection. Yeah amazing and Anki is so incredibly talented. She does the most beautiful really bold colourful amazing looks and she doesn't get anywhere near as much love as she deserves so if you are here and for any reason you don't know who Anki is please 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 head over to her channel check her out you're gonna absolutely love her she is amazing and yeah just beautiful um so yeah so today's video is the building part of the collab creating of the palette, choosing the singles. So if you would like to see what shades I choose for my full autumn palette, which I haven't named yet, then just keep on watching. Okay, so the first selection of shadows I have to swatch are these ones here, which kind of remind me of those autumn rusty leaves. Um, so the first shade I'm going to take is from Wee Cosmetics. Um, I was really bad. I didn't write the names down of any of these or numbers um, when I picked these up. But yeah, I do love the look of this shade. So let's give it a swatch. So... Oh, that is beautiful. Such a beautiful shade. Move over so you can actually see. <laughs> I love that shade. Let's move these down here a sec. Okay, and the next shade I have is from Lethal Cosmetics. It's the shade Cascade. I'm going to swatch that right next to the We We Makeup. We cosmetics, we makeup, I think it is. <laughs> Crikey. If I had a brain, I'd be dangerous. So that is Cascade there. And then we have another one from Lethal Cosmetics. This is the shade Unity. So I am going to swatch that right next to that there. Ooh. The, some of these Lethal Cosmetics shades don't swatch as well as they perform on the eyes. Um, this is one of those. It does perform beautifully on the eyes, though. Um, then next up, we have another Lethal Cosmetics shade. This is Frantic. So, Frantic, I'm going to swatch there. It's beautiful. It's one of my favourite kind of these rusty red kind of shades i do love this this shadow and then we have oh this shade is from the lethal cosmetics and teresa is dead the lethal is dead palette and the shade is vengeful spirits so i'm going to swatch vengeful spirits gorgeous shade and then lastly for this colour selection, this is from M Cosmetics and it is the shade Strawberry Cheesecake. So I'm going to swatch that here. Beautiful. Okay, so what, oh, what am I thinking? Thinking of these leaves. I think I'm gonna go with where am I I'm gonna put I think these two aside yep 
So I'm putting aside Unity and Frantic, both from Lethal Cosmetics. And, oh, yeah, and I'm going to put those other ones out. So the next group of shades I have are these purples. So I'm going to start with Lethal Cosmetics Undone. And swatch that there. That's a beautiful shade. I do love these purples. I don't know if that's going to be the right one for an autumn palette, but we'll see. Then we have Terra Moon's Royal. And I'm going to swatch that. Ooh. I forget how much I love that shade. Then we have, this shade is from the, what's well, Batty Bean now, and Shroud, it's Freaking Bats palette. It is the shade Derry. So I'm going to swatch Derry there. Oh. I have a feeling that one's going to be kind of the perfect one. Um, so yes, there it is Shroud and Batty Bean Dairy. Then we have, this is from Tammy Tanuka, it's the shade 040. This is from the Chinchilla palette. And I'm going to pop that there, that is beautiful. These kind of cool tone, almost grayed purples, it doesn't look as much. It looks a bit brighter on the camera. How bizarre. It's definitely more muted, more grayed than it's showing up. Um, yeah, stunning. And then we have Lethal Cosmetics shade Release. And yeah, I'm not sure on that one that's going to be the right kind of shade mm. then we have night call also from lethal cosmetics it's difficult with purples trying to get the the right kind of tone i think for an autumn feel um so these are the six shades i have i think definitely dairy definitely is going to go in the maybe pile and oh hmm you know whether or not to put hmm i'm thinking probably undone or am i Oh, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Hmm. I don't know. No, I think the others are just too... Are they? Are they, though, Steph? I think I'm going to put the Tammy Tanuka 040 in the maybe pile and pop those out. So I'll just get these off of my hand. Okay, so the next group are these more grungy greens. I'll move the other shades over. So first up, I have this Tammy Tanuka Sigil Inspired Shade 100. This is from the Snake Palette. So I'm going to swatch that here. Oh, yeah, see, I think that's a... Uh, a really good one look at that beautiful um and then i'm going to swatch a uh, syncope syncope uh, from lethal cosmetics and this is one of my favorite shades from lethal cosmetics i love that shade look at that that is beautiful and then this little we makeup Grungy green shade, which again, I didn't write down the names or numbers of the shades when I got them. And oh, that's beautiful. That is 
gorgeous. I love that shade. And then let's grab this one. So this is Sydney Grace Bravo. This is from the Mel Thompson um, In Memory Collection. Ooh. Look at that. Ooh. This is going to be a really tough one. Doesn't help that green's my favourite colour. And then we have this Tammy Tanuka 097. This is also from the Snake palette. There. I think that one's going to be a bit too kind of spring green. I do love those shades. Then we have Dirty Martini, and this is from Makeup Geek. Gorgeous greens. Oh, I love these shades. I love them so much. And then finally we have Glam Shop. And this is Swiak. Swiak. I have no idea how you say that. I apologise. Um, and I'll pop that there. Oh, crikey, this is a tough one. This is a real tough one. What am I going to pop in there? I'm definitely thinking... these two between these two definitely so the sydney grace bravo and the we makeup um grungy green hmm any of the others i don't know oh i don't know no, I think I think those two are going to be, so those two there are the only ones I'm going to pop in the maybe pile. So I'll just get these cleaned off. Okay, so this is the last section of mattes I have to swatch. And they're all these kind of autumn-y, mustardy yellows, greens. Yeah, greeny yellows. I don't know. I don't know what you call them. I'm terrible at describing shades. So the first shade I have is Preppy. And this is from Makeup Geek. And I'm going to swatch that there. That's gorgeous. That is a really beautiful shade. And then we have... Uh, Desert Sands, and this is also from Makeup Geek. Put that right next to it. I think that is going to be a bit more kind of Desert Sands, exactly as the name suggests. Um, then we have Torment from Lethal Cosmetics. This is going to be an easier easier one oh it's kind of that orangey shade that is beautiful hmm um then i have this little one here from we makeup again don't know the name of it i'm gonna plonk that there okay okay i don't know if they're looking more similar on camera than they are in in real life but yeah bizarre um okay so the next shade i have here is more green and this one is from the lethal cosmetics one up palette it is the shade insert coin so i'll pop that here again some of these lethal cosmetics shades don't swatch as well as they perform on the eyes but that is insert coin and then i have another we makeup shade and i'll pop that right next to it and that's a bit too yellow a bit more mm. yeah not so sure there um and then we have daybreak also from lethal cosmetics and 
that there. Again, I think that's going to be too yellow. Beautiful shade. I'll get this one out of the way. This is from the Lethal Cosmetics The Roots palette. And it is the shade Runeck. Yeah, I think the whole of that row are going to be a bit too, like, happy yellow. <laughs> it sounds horrible saying it like that. But yeah, mm, not so sure. Um, the next shade I have here, this is from one of the Lethal Cosmetics, the Six Pan palettes from the same collection as The Roots. And I cannot remember which one it's from. And I haven't stuck the name on, so I suck. I'm sorry. I'm going to pop that next to that there. Yeah, I don't think that's going to go anyway. Hmm. Neil. And then we have Recluse from Lethal Cosmetics. I think the rest of these mats here are from Lethal Cosmetics. And I'm going to pop that there. Ooh. I love that shade. It's so pretty. And then we have Runaway again from Lethal Cosmetics. Oh, look at that. A really beautiful grungy green. Then we have Esteem, also from Lethal Cosmetics. I did say these last ones were all from there, but apparently I'm saying it anyway. That shade there that is beautiful and then finally we have law and it's from the lethal cosmetics roots palette and that there okay so what are we thinking oh i'm definitely thinking this shade here hmm yeah, definitely thinking that shade there. And I'm not sure if I want to add... I think I do want to add this. Like a greeny... I think I'm going to add these two as maybes. So, Lethal Cosmetics Torments and the Lethal Cosmetics Insert Coin from the 1UP palette. Do I want to add anything else as possible? And I think actually, yeah, I'm going to put Recluse in as a maybe as well from Lethal Cosmetics and pop them aside. So I'm going to get this washed off and I'll get out all of the shimmers to go through. Okay, now on to the shimmers. So I've got these few here. So I've picked out these are the more kind of, I don't know, orangey, yellowy, all different kinds. Okay, so the first shade I have here is from Glam Shop and it is the shade Mio, Mio Dolka. This one here. And I'm going to pop that right here. That is beautiful. Look at that. Please excuse Mr. Fluff. He thinks he's being starved. He is not. He has food. Um, and then we have from Lethal Cosmetics, Equinox. And pop that right next to it. Okay. Beautiful shades. And then, oh crikey, this is one from Makeup by Lisa. And I cannot remember for the life of me the name of this one that's that beautiful okay and then we have as uh, this is from tip mouse cosmetics which they have closed down i believe and this is stephanie and pop that there oh it's so beautiful. I do love that shade. It they all look a bit cooler toned on camera than they actually are in front of me. How bizarre. Okay. And then we have 
this is from the Pastel Roses UK. This is California. I think we need to have some kind of orangey shade. I'm going to pop that to the left there. Oh, look at that. It's beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh my god, this is so difficult. And then we have from Glam Shop, this is Toast. I believe this is one that came in the advent calendar. And I'm going to pop that there. Oh, look at that. I think that's going to be a bit too pinky. But oh, look at that shade. It's so pretty. And then we have Covet from Lethal Cosmetics. I'll pop that right next to... Ooh. That looks stunning. And then next up we have Beach Please. Um, and I believe this is from Popping Glow. Um, which is a brand that is no longer around, sadly. UK indie brand. Oh, oh, look at that. That is so pretty. Please excuse Mr. Fluff. <laughs> that is so pretty. I love that shade. Ooh. Okay, and then we have from Glam Shop. Um... I have no idea how to pronounce that. This one here. Um, probably easier if I show you those ones rather than butcher the names. Okay. That's pretty. That is really pretty. I believe that one... Jace, shush. I believe that one was in the advent calendar also. And then from S&B Beauty, which is a UK indie brand, this is Dasha. Pull that there. So that is Dasha. That is stunning. Look at that. Okay, and next up is from Lethal Cosmetics, and this is from one of those six pan palettes, and I cannot remember which one. Um, so, yes, yeah, so let's pop that here. Oh, that's pretty. So pretty. Okay, and then this is from We Makeup. Again, I don't know the name or number of this shade, um, but it is gorgeous. Look at that. That's a really beautiful kind of full autumn shade. That is gorgeous. And then we have, from Sydney Grace, we have Blushed. And I'll pop that here. Oh, it's so pretty. How am I going to choose? I have no idea. Okay. And then from SB Beauty, we have Donna. And oh, this shade is just beautiful. Look at that. Really stunning. Stunning foil shade. Oh, so pretty. And then the last two from this section we have here are the oranges. So this is from SB Beauty. I have cat hair on it. This is Savage Sammy. And oh, look at that. So beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. And then the last one in this section is from Glam Shop and it is Sundew. Oh, look at that. So pretty. Okay, so, well, this is going to be a tough one. 
Really tough one. I think... Oh, crikey. Oh, crikey. What am I going to go with? Some shades. Well, I think... I'm going to have to go with this shade here, definitely. And this one, maybe? These two? Oh, that gold. That is so pretty. I don't know if it's going to go. Um, oh. I think, okay, I'm going to go with this shade here, so Glam Shop Sundew. This shade here, so that is Beach Please from Pop and Glow. Oh, others. Oh, and this one here. So this is Toast from Glam Shop. I think that's it. Is that it? Well, I think I'm going to pop this one. So Sydney Grace Blushed. Yep. So just those four. And they're going over in the maybe. So I'm just going to get these washed off okay so next up we have the greens so the first shade i have is from the lethal cosmetics one up palette and this is the shade high score i'm not sure if it's going to be too blue toned yeah it's going to be too blue Oh, but it's so pretty. So pretty. Um, okay, let's pull it up there. And then next up we have from Sigil Inspired by Tammy Chanuka 098. And this is from the Snake Palette. Oh, I absolutely love these shadows. Look at that. Look. It's so beautiful. The table's starting to look shiny in different colours. I love that. And then from Glam Shop Poland, we have this shade. I don't know how to pronounce that. It is this shade here. And I believe this one was in the Advent Calendar also. That's cute. gonna have a nice green hand um and then next up is 099 from Sigil inspired by tammy tanuka from the snake palette this is one of my favorite green shades ever i love this look at that it's so pretty so pretty how can you not fall in love with that shade? Um, and then next up, we have Florida from the Pastel Roses UK. And this is another one of my favourite green shades. Look at that. It's beautiful. I don't know if that's going to be a bit too kind of... Hmm, I don't know. We'll see, we'll see. Okay, and next up... I have this shade here and this is from the Shroud and Batty Bean It's Freaking Bats palette and it is the shade Grim. So let me pop that here. Again, I think that's going to be too blue toned. Yeah, very much too blue toned. But how stunning. Um, then we have from Sydney Grace. This is Commission. 
think this is more of a gold than a green looking at it next to the others like a greeny gold and I'm going to pop that right there yeah a greeny gold another one's just so pretty beautiful beautiful shade and then next up from Tammy Tanuka 096 this is also from the snake palette beautiful shade put that there oh look at that it's so pretty so pretty and then we have from s b beauty moon face absolutely gorgeous shade oh look at that how gorgeous does that look my hand is looking so pretty and then also from s b beauty is blitzen with a cat hair attached to it this is blitzen that's gorgeous but i think that's gonna be too i don't think that's quite gonna go stunning shade stunning and then we have also from s b beauty this is zombie flesh and here is zombie flesh gorgeous And then the last in this section, I think shouldn't have been in this section. Nope, I'll move that over. Okay, so these shades here. Oh, what ones are going to go? Oh, see, this definitely. See, I want to say that, but I don't think that's very, very autumn yeah i think i'm gonna say this one here Ooh, i don't know i think this one definitely so this is 096 from sigil inspired by tammy tanuka and then i'm thinking oh hmm oh my god this is so difficult why is this so difficult I think I might go with Zombie Flesh from s &B Beauty. Okay, yeah. And the others I'm going to pop aside. So I'm just going to clean these off. Okay, so the final shimmer section to go through. And this is kind of the purpley, ready, burgundy tones um so this shade here is from the lethal is dead palette the lethal cosmetics and Teresa is dead and it is the shade ancient evil so, up there and let's watch that there i think that's going to be too hmm. Do love that shade though um and then we have from glam shop this is pink frog I think this one is gonna yeah i think that one's gonna be gorgeous or you're seeing the kind of purpley tone and if you're gonna be able to see the green yeah i think i think you can hopefully um but yes that is gorgeous there next up is from the pastel roses uk and it is cinnabar rose and i'm gonna pop that right next to it oh look at that it's such a beautiful kind of orangey red shade i love that Ooh. Um, and next up from Glam Shop Poland, we have Pink Sorbet and a very noisy Mr. Fluff. <laughs> so pop that there. 
go again. I just think that's going to be too pinky, but it's so pretty. So pretty. <laughs> and then we have from the Pastel Roses UK Red Grape. Pop that there. Again, I think that one's going to be too pinky also, but so pretty. So pretty. I'm not complaining because I get to swatch all these beauties. <laughs> so let's grab this. So next up we have Euphoria from Lethal Cosmetics. And I'm going to pop that there. Oof. That looks promising. Look at that. Oh, such beautiful pretties. Um, and then we have from s &B Beauty Old Blush. So let's see. This one looks like. Oh, look at that. That is so beautiful. I don't know how many times I'm going to say the word beautiful. So beautiful. Um, but it really is. And then from Lethal Cosmetics, we have Enigma, which I think is going to be too much of a pinky purple. Yeah. But again, just look how beautiful it is. Beautiful, stunning, gorgeous. I love it. And then we have from Glam Shop Poland, this is Multi Unicorn. Love this shade. Look at that. It's such a beautiful multi-chrome. Oh, that is stunning. Absolutely stunning. And then, oh, I'm knocking them all over the place here. From s &B Beauty, we have Spellcasting. And pop that in. Here, oh, oh, okay, that's that's a good one. How gorgeous is that? Okay, and then also from S and B Beauty, we have Cupid. Another absolutely stunning shade. I'm trying to pick words that aren't beautiful constantly. <laughs> Um, and then from Sydney Grace, we have Winter Garden. I adore this shade. It's so pretty and unique. I love it. Look at that. Beautiful. And then from Sigil Inspired by Tammy Tanuka, we have 042. Um, so this is from the Chinchilla palette. It's gorgeous, a taupey colour. I won't do that, Steph. Stop trying to describe colours. And then we have from Glam Shop Firecracker. That there, gorgeous shade. They're just absolutely stunning. I do love my shimmers. And then finally, this is from the Batty Bean and Shroud It's Freaking Bats palette. And the shade name is Apparition. So, Apparition. And I'll pop that there. Okay. Okay, Steph. <laughs> How are we going to choose? Well... Wow. I'm going to have to go with, I think that's Pink Frog, isn't it? Yeah. I'm going to have to go with Pink Frog from Glam Shop Poland. On there. Um, um, Spellcasting from S&B Beauty, which is this one here. Is that it? Yeah. 
I think that will do, Steph. What that? Yeah. Okay, that'll do. Right, I am gonna get these washed off, and then we will see what we've got, and yeah, see if we can condense it to twelve. So, just a second. Okay, so I've got all of my maybes off to the side here. Um, I'm just going to first pick out the ones I think I definitely, definitely want in here. And I'm going to say Derry from the Shroud and Batty Bean It's Freaking Bats palette. I think that needs to go in there, definitely. Um... The ones do I definitely, definitely want in. Um, the Glam Shop Poland Pink Frog Multichrome. Oh, it's so pretty. Um, so I've got to whittle these. I think it's 17 I've got and I need 12. So it's not too, too bad. Not too, too bad. I definitely want to bring in this lighter green. I think it needs that kind of pop. And, oh, where are we going to go to next? We're going to go Sydney Grace Blush. Or, no, I think I'm going to go for Beach. Is it Beach, please? Um, from Popping Glow, which sadly is no longer around. But I think that's going to go beautifully. I definitely want to put in Sydney Grace Bravo. I'll pop that over there. And, oh. Do I need both of those? I don't think I need both of those. Oh, I'm going to go with the Sigil Inspired by Tammy Chinooka 096 from the Snake Palette. Um, Glam Shop Toast or no, I think I'm going to go with Glam Shop Sundew. I pop that. Down there. Ooh. Um, crikey. I don't want blush. Do I want? I think I'm going to go with spell casting from SB Beauty. I think that's going to. Where is it? I don't think I need that with that. Maybe I should use toast instead. Maybe not. Oof. Hmm, I'm going to put Torment in from Lethal Cosmetics and Recluse from Lethal Cosmetics. I definitely need to pop those in. So have I got one, two, three, four, five mats. Um... I'm thinking I'm going to pop this shade in, move that over, pop that, I need to move them over a bit more. <laughs> um, I'm liking how that's looking, so that, that's going to be too much of that. Oh, don't want that green, maybe. Maybe. I think that purple just kind of makes it that little bit different. Yeah, I don't need any more of these shades. Oh, should I go with that? Or that? Oh, I think. Hmm. Okay, this is tough. This is so tough. Hmm. If I move that, I think it doesn't look right because of that being there. So I'm going to move those. I'm going to pop that there and that there. And then do I want to put that there? It's an awful lot of greens then. What should I go with that purple? How does that look? No. No, no, no. I think. Oh. 
Is that it? Is that? Is it though? Oh, I'm so not sure. I think I might take this, no, this one out. Should I take that out and pop that? Oh, okay. Okay, I'm I'm liking the look of that. Oh. Okay. Yes. So the four that are not going to make it into the palette are Recluse from Lethal Cosmetics. Toast from Glam Shop Poland, Blushed from Sydney Grace, Unity from Lethal Cosmetics, and this Wee Makeup one. So, the shades we have are, this is Derry from the Shroud Cosmetics and Bashy Bean It's Freaking Bats palette. Then we have, can I get that out? That's Pink Frog <laughs> from Glam Shop Poland. Um, this is from the Lethal Cosmetics 1-Up palette. That is the shade Insert Coin. Then we have, that's Beach Please from Popping Glow. Um, Spellcasting from s &B Beauty. Torment from Lethal Cosmetics, um, Zombie Flesh from s &B Beauty, Bravo from Sydney Grace, Get that out. 096 from Sigil Inspired by Tammy Tanuka. Uh, 040 from Sigil Inspired by Tammy Tanuka. Uh, Sunju from Glam, Glam Shop Poland. And last but not least, Frantic from Lethal Cosmetics. So yeah, guys, I think that is my full autumn themed palette. Hmm. I'm pretty happy with that. I'm pretty happy with that. So I'm going to go and pop these other bits away and then I'll come, come back and wrap up with you. So I will see you in just a moment. Okay, guys, so I am back to the, the me. You can see me and not just my hands. So, my full autumn palette, which I will find a name for. I just, I can't come up with one right now. So, this is what she looks like. I am super happy with how it turned out. I think I kind of aimed for the more grungy autumn vibe. And yeah, super happy with it. And I would usually swatch at the end of this video. But this time... You get the video on Thursday, which will be the swatch party. So I will one by one swatch them, show you what the colour story looks like all swatched out together. And then on Saturday will be the two looks video. I'm just super excited. I cannot wait to create looks with this. Yeah, super excited. And I cannot wait to see Anki's palette and what shades she chose and if we've gone for similar at all. So yeah, Anki, thank you so, so much for reaching out to me. I'm super excited to be doing this collab with you. And guys, like I said before, please go and check Anki out if you haven't already. You are going to love her. Um, the makeup I have on my face, um, I will list it all in the description box below. I didn't film it. Um, I did use my singles from Sydney Grace, um, singles from the Mel Thompson, like the memory bundle, um, which was a gift from my beautiful friend Jeanette. And yeah, I'm really happy with how it came out. Um, so yeah, I thought it was the perfect look, a nice look to film this video, the intro and the outro with. Um, so yeah, everything will be in the description box below 
for if you want to know what else is on my face and guys please head over and watch Anki's video I shall be doing that I cannot wait and I cannot wait to see yeah if there's any similarities we'll see so yes if you've enjoyed this please do like this video it really helps me out if you are new if you've come over from Anki's channel hello welcome I'm Steph I love indie makeup I love colorful makeup just having fun with makeup so if that sounds like something you'd be interested in then please do consider subscribing come and hang out with me some more I would love that and thank you all for again watching spending time with me i hope you're all having a great day great evening wherever you are and whatever you're doing i hope you're taking care of yourselves i will see you all again very very soon <laughs> goodbye yeah. stepping in the spa like she own it looking like the world is your runway she can set it off like a gun play oh my yeah talk of the city with the body always getting praised like it's sunday she said, baby, what you gonna do about it?